Salute. Okay, guys, I want to give you a martial art tip. A lot of times we're learning all this martial arts, but we're not learning about reality of self-defense. See this man behind me? Well, he's not a man. He's a teenager, only 15 years old. And what I try to teach our 15-year-olds, and I say you should be teaching teenagers as well, we have to teach our teenagers just in case they get stopped or they get questioned by law enforcement that they are not to try to justify or explain themselves. The thing that he needs to do right away is, officer, I am a minor. Officer, I'm only 15 years old. And he can give his mother's phone number, give his mother's name, but under no condition should he talk to the police. Under no condition should he try at any way to explain himself to the matter of whatever happened. Police are investigators. You notice they'll say, we're detaining you because we're doing our investigation. That's very important. So them being investigators, you need to not help them with their investigation. He's not old enough. He doesn't understand what an investigation really is. He's only 15 and he'll wind up being one of the Central Park Five. I all tell parents you need to watch the story and read about the Central Park Five because it's very important that we teach our young boys you have the right to remain silent. So when you're dealing with police officers, let them know you're a minor, how old you are, let them know who your parents are, and what I told you when you have your phone, you need to know your parents' number by heart. Not just in the cell phone, but you need to know that number by heart. And that is self-defense. Salute.